hello my lovely people welcome back to my channel thank you so much for choosing to watch this video if you are new here you are welcome to my channel and thank you to my sustaining subscribers and all my subscribers i'm really grateful to you guys today i want to share with you how i grow my whole chicken in the oven for christmas and my chicken is already cleaned so i'm just going to marinate chicken and then I will keep it for some hours in the fridge and then we will see how it goes so my chicken I will set it aside and in here I'm going to add my chicken season will come in just enough add some vegetable seasonings I'll add some white pepper my black pepper will come I'll also add some garlic powder Also go ahead and add some ginger powder I'll also add some chili powder will also come in I want it spicy so and I'll go ahead and add some chili sauce from the Chinese shop will also come in and I'll add some olive oil and I'll give it a good mix I'm now going to season with salt before I put my seasoning on. So I'll add salt to every side of my chicken. And also inside. So I will now start with my
now going to cover it with a plastic bag or a plastic and then I will keep it in the fridge if you are doing it the next day you can keep it for overnight or you keep it for at least two to three hours and you can grill it in the oven so we will continue and my lovely people my chicken has been marinated overnight so I'm now going to stuff my chicken with potato carrots and in here this is it so I'm going to marinate this one also a bit with vegetable seasoning and this is it so I'm going to stuff it inside my chicken to go inside And the rest, I'm just going to add it in here. And this will go into the oven for at least two hours. It shouldn't be too hot so that the inside will be well cooked or baked. So, this is it. My chicken will now go into the oven and today I'm also going to make coleslaw or cabbage salad so I'm just going to slice my and this is my coleslaw nicely done so I'm going to transfer into my serving bowl and I'll keep it in the fridge until I'm done with my cooking because it tastes nice when you have it cold So let's continue with our dinner for Christmas and now I'm going to be cooking potato also we are going to have potato I will just cook it and then afterwards I will grease it with olive oil and it will go into the oven so I'm just going to add salt to cook I'm also preparing some vegetables in here. I've already added some chopped garlic to it. So I'm just going to season it with salt and some vegetable seasons will also go in. I'll also add some or a little bit of olive oil just to roast it. I will mix it and I'm going to roast this in the oven and we are also going to enjoy it with our meal today. So this will go into the oven. And my potato is well cooked so I'm just going to add some vegetable seasoning here and also add some dry spring onions to it and I'll add some olive oil 
and I'm going to bake it in the oven for just 10 minutes and this is also part of my dinner for today so this will go into the oven now and I'm also going to prepare some vegetable rice or fried rice so I'll just add my oil in here and my onion will come in I'm now going to add my carrots I'll now add my spray onion. I'll now add some powder pepper, garlic powder. Some vegetable seasoning. My rice will come in now. I will now add some soya sauce. Soya sauce. And my rice for today is also done. So we will continue with our next dish. And my lovely people, I'm also going to make some chicken tenders. I've already cleaned and cut them in the sizes. So I'll add milk. And also add, I want it spicy, so I'll add one chili teaspoon. I'll also add some garlic powder, black pepper, white pepper, and also add some two different kinds of chicken season and I'm just going to mix it well I'll also add some salt to taste I will marinate this for 30 minutes and then I will deep fry it.
it's been 30 minutes so i'm going to continue with my chicken tender it's in here so i'm just going to dip it into the egg into the egg and i'll drop it in here in my breadcrumbs it's here and i'll cover it all with the breadcrumbs so i'll do the same to all of them and my oil is also heating already Let's fry. almost done and my chicken is nicely fried you can see how it looks, it looks nice lovely people this is my Christmas dinner for my family and it's taking me a whole day to cook and you can see how beautiful my table looks I have everything on that table you can see my chicken I have fried rice I have big potatoes I have coleslaw I have kebab I have chicken tender, my daughters made um, cornbread and we are going to enjoy our Christmas now. So thank you so much for keeping up with me and please do give this video thumbs up and I will be grateful. And if you are new here, you are welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for choosing to watch my videos, I'm really grateful. I wish all of you a Merry Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.